girls. She's a small wonder, a child unlike other girls. She's a miracle, and I grant you, she'll enchant you at her sight. She's a small wonder, and she'll make your heart take flight. La, 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 la. Microchips here and there She's a small wonder Brings love and laughter everywhere The cake What? The cake is almost done Five, four, three, two, one. <laughs> oh, bless your little built-in timer. What would I do without my pretty robot? You'd have a burnt cake. <laughs> Open it up. Oh, it's beautiful. Well, you can be proud of your first cake, Vicky. Here, take it out. Huh? Then that's it. Now I'll show you how to frost it. Put it down. Put it down. <laughs> oh, no. I keep forgetting that a robot takes things literally. Oh, dang. Hi, girls. Hi. Hi. What, uh, what happened to the cake? I guess I wasn't very explicit with Vicky. All I said to her was put it down. <laughs> and I did it again. Dummy. Dummy. <laughs> well, honey, you're always saying your floors are clean enough to eat off of. <laughs> well, I better go clean it up. Honey, let her do that. Vicky, clean up the cake. Clean up the cake. We've got more important things to discuss here. Oh, such as? Such as with Jamie away at this weekend on his camping trip. It'll be the first time we've been alone in years. Oh, I know. So why don't we get away too, huh? You know, there's that romantic little resort up at Pine Lake. Oh, I'd love that. Mm. Mm. Even if the trout aren't biting, I will be. <laughs> <laughs> be like a second honeymoon. Yeah. Growl. <laughs> Come here. Hi. Hi, Reg. Hi, Reggie. Hi, Vicky. What's well, new? A second honeymoon. Growl. <laughs> uh, Jamie's in his room, Red. Thanks. I'm afraid I have some bad news for him. Well, what's that? Our camping trip is off. My dad has to work this weekend, so he can't take us. Oh, oh no. Uh, you must be terribly disappointed, Reggie. I try to keep a stiff upper lip. Stiff upper lip. <laughs> That's very difficult to do. Poor Jamie, he'll be crushed. So am I. There goes our second honeymoon. Grrrr. <laughs> hey, Jamie. You all packed for the camping trip? I've got news. The camping trip is off. What? Are you sure? Positive. <laughs> what you do? Why you tell your dad you hate camping? No way. He has to work. It will break his heart if he ever knew I only go camping so he can act macho. You're right. When you have parents, you've got to make sacrifices. <laughs> Since we're not going, give me back that doll I gave you so you can come with me. Sorry, I never let friendship get in the way of business. <laughs> come on, Jamie. I'm a little short. Take vitamins. You'll grow. <laughs> well, anyway, the important thing is we don't have to go camping. Right. No fresh air and no healthy exercise. Uh -uh. Right. The only hiking we'll do is to refrigerator and back. Yeah! Hey, guys. <laughs> Look how unhappy they are. Yeah. Our little hearts are broken. <laughs> but we'll try and get over it. Well, guess what? You guys are still going to go on that camping trip this weekend. 
Say what? <laughs> Dad, it's not nice to toy with a kid's feelings. Oh, no. Your father is going to take all of us. Yeah. You, Reggie, Vicky, and me. Isn't that wonderful? <laughs> <laughs> Honey, look, they're speechless. <sighs> it's just such a wonderful shock. The reaction hasn't hit our brains yet. <laughs> yeah, right. Um, but Mr. Lawson, do you know anything about camping? <laughs> reg, Reg, Reg. <laughs> I come from a long line of campers. When I was a kid, my grandfather, Jedediah, <laughs> taught me everything there is to know about wilderness survival. They used to call me Grizzly Lawson. Your grandfather told me it was because your snoring woke up all the bears. Look, Dad, you don't have to take us camping. Don't forget your bad back. I don't have a bad back. You could get one. <laughs> Jamie, look, don't worry about me. Huh? We're going camping and that's it. Honey, come and help me get that camp stove out of the garage. Uh -huh. Boy, I can smell the bacon and eggs frying already. <laughs> Wait, Dad. You're not planning on doing the cooking, are you? <laughs> well, sure, why not? Don't you remember what happened when you tried to barbecue in the backyard? What's it mean, honey? It wasn't that bad, was it? Not at all. Your eyebrows grew back very quickly. <laughs> There's not a straight man left in America. Camping. <laughs> yes, that's it. We're stuck. What do you mean, we? They're your parents, not mine. I could get out of it. You wouldn't. I was going to go when it was your parents. That's because I paid you a dollar. Okay. <laughs> so I owe you a dollar. It's going to cost you two dollars. Two? <laughs> yeah, one for going with you and one for eating your dad's cooking. <laughs> John, what on earth are you doing with all those boxes of food? Well, they're supplies for the camping trip. Better safe than sorry. Why don't we just take the refrigerator? <laughs> take the refrigerator. <laughs> Vicky, come here. I want you to scan this book and put it in your memory bank. In my memory bank, Camper Survival and First Aid Manual. I want a program just in case. In case of what? Snake bite, broken limbs, concussion, poisoning, frostbite. <laughs> Sounds like a fun weekend if we live. <laughs> Hi, Harriet. I see you're packing for your camping trip. Oh, that's right. Uh, did Jamie tell you about it? No, I heard it through the grapevine. <laughs> what grapevine? The one outside Jamie's bedroom window. <laughs> Harriet, you really shouldn't do that. Now, what would your mother say if she knew that you were snooping around? Nothing. I learned it from her. <laughs> what are you reading, Vicky? Camper Survival and First Aid Manual. Oh, you mean how to get rid of all kinds of pests? No, there's nothing in here about you. <laughs> She's just making a joke, honey. <laughs> Listen, Harriet, we've got a lot more packing to do before we leave, so if you'll excuse us, please. Did I ever tell you about a girl I know? I don't think so. This poor, deprived child has never been camping. Isn't that sad? Yes, that is sad. Who is the child? Me. <laughs> oh, Harriet, you're something else. Ted. All right, she can come camping with us. Oh, thank you. But only if your parents say that it's all right. Why don't you go ask them now? I already did. They even packed for me. Why am I not surprised? They said with me gone, they could go away for a second honeymoon. I'll be right back. 
I resent them going on our second honeymoon. Yeah, well, if I was married to her mother, I'd fish. <laughs> My dad wouldn't have let Harriet come with us. I got car sick before I even got in the car. <laughs> Ted, it's gonna get dark soon. How much farther is it to the campground? I'm starving. We've been walking over an hour since we parked the car. I'm so hungry, I can eat a pine cone. How about you, Vicky? Eat a pine cone. No, 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 Vicky. <laughs> Funny kid, huh? Ted, I've got to rest a minute. <sighs> Hey, 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 why don't we set up camp right here, huh? I mean, we don't need tables and benches and barbecue pits and showers and all that stuff, do we? Yes! <laughs> Come on, it'll be more fun this way. Trust me, let's get unpacked. Okay, Reggie, you gather some rocks for a fire break. Yep. Harriet, you unpack the utensils. Aye, aye, sir. Okay, Jamie, you and Vicky unroll the tent right here. Bingy! Boy, isn't this fun, Joni? <laughs> yes, dear. <laughs> what would you like me to do? Try not to panic. What? Why would I panic? Do you have any idea where we are? <laughs> oh, don't you know where we are? Of course I know where we are. Where? We're lost. <laughs> yeah, I thought you were going to use that old survival technique of marking our trail. I did. I did mark the trail with, uh, with popcorn. <laughs> then what happened? Harriet ate them. <laughs> Ted, you must have some rough idea about where we are. Uh, roughly, yes, roughly, roughly we're in North America. <laughs> Popcorn? Huh? <laughs> <laughs> How about that, huh? Oh, huh? Ted, huh? I'm impressed. Uh, you know, the instructions look so complicated, but you did a beautiful job. Oh, no, honey, it was nothing. I mean, it was so easy a child could have done it. A child did do it. Listen, <laughs> uh, kids don't know we're lost, do they? No, I didn't say a word. I didn't want to frighten them. Good, right. What's the matter? Harry, what is it? There was a monster out there. What'd you do, scare it? <laughs> Jamie. He chased me and ran it back in the tent. Harriet, Harriet, I'm sure there's no monster in the tent. It's probably nothing at all. Vicky, go see what it is. Ted! Honey, I'm kidding. It's a joke, all right? Vicky, follow me. Really? I'm still kidding, you know. Dad, <laughs> <laughs> what is it? It's a lizard. It's just a baby. Yeah, but it went like this. <laughs> <laughs> Jamie, you can let it go now. I don't know. Maybe we should keep it till we taste Dad's cooking. <laughs> That'll be enough out of you, wise guy. Okay, Dad. Okay, we're gonna need some more wood for the fire. So, Jamie, you and Reggie, take Vicky and go in that direction, and I'll go in that direction. Gotcha. Come on, Vicky. And Harriet, you make up the beds in the tent, okay? Okay. But what if that lizard comes back again? He can make up his own bed. <laughs> Listen, I'm gonna go look for some help. I mean, there's, there's gotta be a forest ranger, some campers out here somewhere. Ted, it's gonna be dark soon. What if you get lost? How can I get lost when I'm already lost? <laughs> Just be careful, okay? Don't worry. I mean, what could happen? I don't know. At night, you, you could fall off a cliff or, or be mauled by a lion or, or maybe fall into an old mine shaft. I'll go first thing in the morning. <laughs> Here's a good spot. Yeah. Don't just stand there, Vicky. Pick up some wood. Pick up some wood. <laughs> no, Vicky, put it down. <laughs> wow. How she do that? Uh, we groot. <laughs> I meant little pieces of wood, Vicky. Okay? Okay. Boy, I knew this camping trip was gonna be the pits. Tell me about it. 
What's the matter, Vicky? I smell something. Uh-oh. Maybe it's a skunk. I hope his tail isn't pointing at us. <laughs> it is not a skunk. I smell chili dogs. Chili dogs? I think she's got mountain fever. <laughs> if she says she smells them, she does. Her micro sensors are never wrong. Her what? I mean, she's got a nose like a bloodhound. <laughs> are you sure, Vicky? The smell is definitely chili dogs with onions. <laughs> it's coming from that direction. Let's see. What's this? A zoo and a snack bar. Hey, there it is over there. All right. All right. We're safe from dad's cooking. <laughs> We better not tell him about this. He's having too much fun playing Indiana Jones. <laughs> this is our little secret, Vicky. Got it? Got it. Come on. Let's get over there and pick out. Yeah. Harper and C, here we come. Come on, Vicky. <laughs> Mmm, good stuff, huh? Huh? Hey, you guys hardly ate anything. Well, I guess we're just too excited about being here to eat. Right, Reggie? <laughs> That's right, Mr. Lawson. Call me Grizzly. <laughs> Vicky didn't eat anything at all. I do not eat. Oh, she means she's a light eater. <laughs> well, you ate, Harriet. Uh, how'd you like my baked potatoes? Those the little black lumps or the big black lumps? <laughs> Those were the big black lumps. The little black lumps were the steaks. <laughs> Come on, guys, we gotta get this stuff cleaned up before we hit the sack. We don't want to attract any ants. No ant would touch the stuff. <laughs> Pardon me, Jamie? Nothing, Dad. She said no ant would touch the stuff. <laughs> oh, he was kidding, honey. You know ants will eat anything. <laughs> Thank you very much, dear. <laughs> Come on, everybody. Come on, kids. Oh, uh, why don't you get everything all ready and we can turn in, huh? Jamie, we can be there. Yeah. There you go. Sweetie. A lot right of food going to waste there. <clears throat> yeah. Mr. Lawson? Yes, Harry. Does the sun come up early in the morning here? Oh, yes, it'll be a bright, sunshiny morning. That's what I was afraid of. I like to sleep late. <laughs> Good night. Good night. Good night, Harry. Good night, honey. Good night. Oh. Was, uh, uh, crickets. Crickets? Yeah, they, uh, they, they make that sound by uh, rubbing their hind legs together. <laughs> Nothing to worry about. Back to sleep, everybody. Eh? Come on, girls. Guys? <laughs> Ted, what are they rubbing together now? <laughs> Okay, okay, nobody, nobody panic, nobody oh. panic. Nothing to, nothing to worry about here, except my zipper stuck. See, we're being stalked by a mountain lion. Don't be silly, honey, that's not a mountain lion. Well, don't tell me it's a cricket with a bad cough. <laughs> that's either a lion or a second honeymoon garage. <laughs> <laughs> Wish I had my best dress. I want to look nice when they find our bodies. Dad, let me help you out of that thing. No, 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 Jamie, don't rip it. It's rented. Uh, there's something I'd better tell you, Dad. Not now, Jamie. All right, listen, everybody. Just stay close together. Stay right here. Okay. Old Dad's gonna protect you from that mountain lion. 
I'll protect you from those monkeys, too. <laughs> monkeys? And elephants? How far did we walk? <laughs> I wonder what else is out there. I know what's out there. What? A zoo in a snack bar where Jamie and Reggie pigged out on chili dogs. <laughs> this is our little secret. <laughs> There's a snack bar nearby, and you guys let me eat my horrible cookie. <laughs> Honey, the important thing is that we're not lost. Lost? Who said we're lost? Old Grizzly here. <laughs> well, well, we'll talk about that in the morning. Right now, there's something much more important to do. What's that? See if that snack bar is still open. Yeah! All right. This way. All right, let's go. Come All on, right. Mickey. Okay, let's go. But, um, hey, wait, wait for me, guys. Wait for me. She's a small wonder, brings love.